Hello there, good day to you. We're on the seventh session of our science e lesson, and this is Miss Fern. We also have reached the end of Unit 6. So today you're going to have your inquiry activity, and this will also serve as your project for the unit. You can find this topic on pages 255 to 257 of your textbook. The essential question that we need to consider for today's activity is How can we classify plant products? Once more, can you read it? How can we classify plant products? Very good! Now the first thing that you're going to do is to open your book to page 257. On page 257, you will see this page with the pictures of the different products coming from different natural resources. Now, you don't have to worry. If you cannot find this page, then a PDF file is attached at the end of this presentation. Okay? Now I assume that you were able to get the picture. So now what we're going to do is to cut the picture following the dotted lines. Be very careful with the use of scissors. You can ask your parents to help you or maybe your cousins or big brothers or sisters. Cut all the pictures following the dotted lines. Very good. Keep going. Now we go back to our essential question. What was the question again? Yes, how can we classify plant products? Now this will be your template. You cannot find this in your book. Okay? So what you're going to do is you have to print the PDF file attached at the end of the presentation. If not, no, don't be sad. You can also use an A4 paper to just you uh, to serve as your template for this project or activity. Okay? And you also need you also need a glue to stick your pictures later on. Is that clear? Okay, now let's see what we have. Okay, we have, what's this? Very good, grape jelly. Then we have corn cereal. Maple syrup. Mm -hmm. Seagrass slippers. A straw hat, cotton shirt, peanut butter, mmm, this tastes good, wood table, cotton blankets, okay, so we have how many pictures? We have nine pictures. Now what are we going to do with these pictures? Okay, I want you again to look at your pictures. Okay, so how many pictures do you have? You have nine pictures all together. If you cut them, then you will be having nine pictures. Okay, now what we're going to do is, looking at the picture, I want you first to consider this question. How will you know which product belong in the same group okay again can you read the question okay bravo okay now what we're going to do is if you look at your picture your template template you have three columns there. So now you have to decide. You need to make three groups. 
you have to decide what pictures will go here in the first box, what picture will go to the second box, and what pictures will go to the third box. Okay, let's try peanut butter. So I think I'll put peanut butter here. Then I have here cotton shirt. Maybe I'll put cotton shirt here. Then, okay, I think I will have to put wood table here. What do you think? Okay, so think about the other pictures. Where will you put them and what pictures will be together? Then, after you've finished sticking all the nine pictures, you're going to write a name for each group. Where do you use these things or products? Or what are these products for? So you have to write the name here on top. What about these products? What are these products for? And what about these products here? Looking at your work, I want you to make a conclusion. Okay, your conclusion will also be the answer to number two. So, the question is, what are some kinds of products people make from plants? Again, read with me. What? Some kinds... Very good. So now go back to your picture and try to think about what are some kinds of products people can make from plants. These products we use for. What about these products here? And what about these products here? So I know you can do this by yourself. Okay. Very good. I'll give you time for that. Just be careful when sticking the pictures. It might not fit the paper. So I want to congratulate all of you. Very good for the work done. Please don't forget to send a picture of what you have finished and send it to your portfolio. Thank you very much. And also, the next, the 8th e-lesson will be our assessment for these two e-lessons posted this week. So it will be about natural and natural resources and products. Thank you and bye. Keep safe always.